What is going on, everybody? Thank you for tuning in to another edition of On the Road to Victory. I am your host, Jimmy Smith, and I'm back again. We're going position by position, taking a look before training camp, what this Eagles team looks like, all 89 of the players, and, well, the 90th that's on the commissioner's exempt list was on the last show. So all of the offense is complete. Go check that out. Quarterback, running back, wide receivers, tight ends, offensive line. Get to know every single player on the Eagles. And now we're going through the special teams. And then, of course, we will jump off of the defense tomorrow. So we're going to try to post this late tonight. Hopefully it's not tomorrow morning, but we'll see how the time uh, allows me to do that. But um, I apologize if I'm freezing or anything like that. Don't have my Ethernet, my lights, nothing. This room is filled with crap. Just, yeah. You guys all get it by now, but we're going through each position. Let's do this special teams here. We're going to start it off with the specialists. Then we'll get to the returners here. But we know Jake Elliott, Rick Lovato, two of the best at their position. So they're locked in. Let's F and go. But punter, this is something we've been begging for. Some competition here for Aaron Sipos. We get just that in Ty Zentner, nicknamed Legatron. So, Look, the kid, you know, that's great. You did good in college. We want to see what you do in the NFL. He's going to get his opportunity in camp and the preseason. So, hey, if he's the better man, I hope he wins that damn job. If not, I hope Sippos gets his head out of his ass. We could really, really use that, uh, you know, punter position, especially with the last game we played, you know, that kind of screwing us over. So, um, yeah, I love the fact that there's some competition there. So, I've got two locks there, as you saw, in Elliott and Lovato. On the bubble, Sippos and Zentner for me. But uh, obviously, that's for everybody because, well, they are both on the bubble. Only one will make this squad. So, hey, I'm all about it. At least we got some competition. If they suck, we'll then bring in a veteran. Bring somebody else in. We need all facets of the game to be on the top, baby. Let's go. So, talked about another part in the special teams, and that is the return men. Now, I'm not calling anybody a lock here because – you know, I don't think we're keeping anybody just now. Covey obviously did not make the initial 53, but was brought up to be wide receiver depth and help us in the return game. So maybe you keep him strictly for that, but, uh, you know, going to need to provide something somewhere else too, because you've got lots of guys. So started off with Covey and Scott, our returners from last season. You can see, then you've got guys like Greg Ward, Tyree Cleveland, Nada, Rambo, who have done it before. Then you've got some guys that will be big parts of the offense and one on the defense that, you know, could definitely uh, get their reps in there. And Alameda Zacchaeus, you know, he's got return capability. He'll be the third, fourth wide receiver. So definitely could see him in action. Penny, you know, he's part of that running back by committee. So he did great in college, hasn't done it much in the NFL, but he's got the ability to do it. And the Eagles have been lacking a kick returner. And that's something he can do and did do at San Diego State. So you see the bottom list. These are guys that, eh, I mean, Devontae Smith, it's not because he's not good, but, you know, he's one of our key pieces on offense. If this an important return, get his ass back there. Kenny Gainwell, that was something they were trying out with him, but I think he's going to see an uptick in the offense, but that doesn't mean, you know, Swift, Penny, Gainwell, all getting there is that, you know, one in, or two of these guys couldn't help in the return game. Then Josh Job, last year he saw some work there. He has seen work before there. So Alabama alum, we talked about him making the team last year as an undrafted kid. He did just that. Keep showing your worth. Maybe you can help out in the return game there. But Quez Watkins, he tried that last year and did very badly. So not sure they're going to throw him back there, but maybe they continue to try to help him learn uh, the return game there because he's got great speed. So, hey, who knows? But uh, that's the specialist for you, ladies and gentlemen. And, oh, boy, uh, coming up next, uh, the next couple of days will be defense. So, we're going to break it all down, but I'd love to hear your thoughts on all these. How do you feel about these positions? How do you feel about the special teams? Would you add a return man? Would you go get an Andre Roberts to help shore up the depth at wide receiver and give you an actual kick returner? Let me know how you're feeling. Bringing in another punter, whatever's on your mind, I'd love to hear it, but that's all I've got for you right now. Hope you're all having yourselves a great day. But until next time, I am Jimmy Smith, and this is On the Road to Victory. Hope you all have yourselves a safe evening. Uh, reach out if you need me. But uh, until next time, say it with me now. Go Birds! <laughs>